hey beauties welcome back to my channel if you're new to my channel welcome in today's video guys the long waited charlotte tilbury pillow talk beautifying face palette is finally here and i am so happy that i have managed to get my hands on it so if you guys want to see what this beauty looks like swatches keep on watching okay beauties i'm a bit annoyed because the full I'm guessing this is Charlotte Tilbury's Christmas edition. Not everything has dropped in the UK. So far, I've only managed to get my hands on the beautifying face palette. The eyeshadow, I think it's the Hypnotic Pops. I'll insert the pictures there. Yeah, they have not even dropped yet in London. And I am so, so, so annoyed. Because out of everything, I really wanted to get my hands on those. And also, they're supposed to build like a pink gel crystal liner. It hasn't dropped yet. Went on the website and it literally says out of stock. So fingers crossed, Charlotte Tilbury's gonna be dropping it because I really wanna get my hands on that. But for today, this is the Pillow Talk Beautifying Face Palette. I did get mine in the shade Medium Deep. So fingers crossed, this should come up on my skin tone and we will get straight on into it, guys. Oh, when it comes to Charlotte Tilbury, you guys know I am such a fan of Charlotte Tilbury. So this is the new Pillow Talk Beautifying Face Palette in the shade Medium to Deep. This is the new Beautifying Blush and Glow Pillow Talk Face Palette for the eyes and cheeks. So obviously I'm guessing you're going to be able to use this on the eyes, but I'm specifically going to be using the blush for blush and I'm going to be using the highlighter for highlighter. It does retail for £60. So with this, darlings, Discover my new Pillow Talk Beautifying Face Palette featuring four beautifying blush and glow shades for the eyes, cheeks and face. I'm so excited for the world to fall in love with my latest Pillow Talk icon this holiday season. So yes, this is part of Charlotte Tilbury's holiday collection. Very excited, very, very happy. So guys, without further ado, this is the packaging. This is how it comes. And then if you turn it over, you have the little step-by-step -step there of how you're supposed to use each piece. And then once you look on top, you have Charlotte Tilbury right there. So the longevity of this is 18 months, which is great. So I can't wait. Guys, I am going to get my hands on the little hypnotic pots as soon as it does drop in the uk i saw about two shades that i want to get i think it's the rose gold one and i think there was like a kind of orangey one i think like a rust kind of orangey one definitely want to get my hands on that and obviously as soon as the pink liner does drop i'm getting my hands on it so yes guys we have a lot of holiday christmas editions coming on this channel pat mcgrath has also dropped some of her collection bit by bit i did actually order one of the eyeshadow palettes because I think I got the shade, is it Bronze Galactic or something? It's the bronzy shade. I can't wait till that, guys, comes. I'm definitely going to get my hands on it. The new Chanel collection, yes. You guys, y'all don't even have to worry because you guys know I love Chanel. So I'm definitely going to be getting my hands on the new Chanel Holiday Collection. Also Dior. Yes, I did see the Dior eyeshadow palette. I was eyeing up the burgundy one. I think I might end up getting that, but we'll see guys you want to subscribe to the channel hit the notifications because i'm getting all of the holiday collections that look good this is the packaging i love this charlotte tilbury you went all out with this i love that and then once you turn it over you do have the little step by step there just so you're able to follow the steps in case you don't know what to do okay guys and the plastic has just flew off so this is how it looks okay guys I am excited yes I can already see just by me looking at the palette this is definitely medium deep friendly so I have no qualms this should come up on your girl's skin tone so I'm just gonna grab my makeup brush what I'm going to do I think so, so just to show you this is here, that is here. So I will start with the lightish side first. Okay. Ooh. Okay, let's see how this is going to look. Okay. 
Okay, there's nothing coming up yet. Let's do it twice. So that is just with two taps, even this, yeah. And to be honest guys, you guys know I'm not really this kind of blush person when I do wear my blushes. I do like it to be very like modest. But yeah, this is a nice shade. So that's with two applies. Let's do three. And just intensify that. Just a little bit more will do it. Yeah, this is nice. Really nice. I like that. So I'm going to go ahead and add the highlighter on it as well. So I'm just going down below and I'm going to be using the pillow talk just here. And then we can see what side I prefer. And we'll just add it on top. I am just using sweeping motions. So that is just with one. And then we'll go into it again. The embossing is pretty hard on this, so... I don't think you'll be able to finish this palette so quickly because everything does feel very firm in the palette, firmly pressed. So that is a good thing. And then I'll just tap it on so you guys can see it. So you guys are getting the full effect of it as well. Ooh, yeah. Even this right here, you can definitely see the difference. This side has the blush and the highlighter on the pinky pillow talk highlighter and so i say that this blush is more definitely of like a it looks more like a pinky peachy to me but even this is nice very natural very subtle oh yeah this is nice i like this i think this is definitely a shade that i would more or less wear around and now because i wear i would say i wear deeper blushes more in the winter like now i'm transitioning from going peachy blushes to more like a brownie kind of blush this is nice even for the spring i would say it's very light it's very it's just simple i like this i think i definitely wear this blush for the spring because it's not too overpowering you know we're easing easing we can kind of just loosen up a little bit off the winter this is nice Okay, guys, so I'm going to go into the deeper shade now with the Charlotte Tilbury symbol. Okay, I'm going to be very careful. I'm going to try and be very careful with this. Even I think right now I put too much on my brush already. And we'll see if we can see a difference. Okay, this is definitely firmly pressed. I'm definitely having to go into it. To make sure I can like maximize the potential of the blush but yeah this is pretty firmly pressed in I have to say there's no fallout <laughs> so let's see if we can intensify it so that's about after two to three strokes I'll go in one more time and let's see how it looks Yeah, definitely the winter side, I would say. So I'm gonna go ahead and apply the highlighter. This is the highlighter, definitely looking more like a, a champagne color, I would say. But let's get it on and see. And then I'll just press it in. That's normally how I like to do my highlights. I feel like day to night, but you guys have a look. Let me know what size you guys prefer. Okay, let's have a look and see. Um, you know what? If I had to decide which side I like more, I would go for more of this side. This side just gives me more of a natural look, 
more of something I could just wear like on a day-to-day -day basis even if I'm just going now running to the shop just like out running errands I would go with more with this side this side now I would say if you want something a bit more intense maybe you're going out for the night yeah this would be a very nice look but I think overall I think I prefer this side better I think I do I like it I'm definitely happy with this my final thoughts on the new Charlotte Tilbury beautifying face palette this palette this is 10 out of 10 I like this one I think she came out with a palette last year and I think it was something like this and it was supposed to be for like deep skin tones and that palette was just a total flop hence the reason I made a total pass on it but this beauty right here this right here this is nice now this is medium to deep medium skin tones you're gonna like this medium deep like me this is perfect it's showing up on me definitely if you're deeper that berry shade is gonna pop let's do some swatches and see that is how it looks after I have used the palette I would say just a little bit of fallout just little touches as you guys can see the gold highlight a little bit has just fallen onto the um blush but I would say these are firmly pressed in like this ain't falling apart obviously if you're going to travel with it I would say wrap it up anyway but these are definitely firmly pressed in and even to get the pigment out you do have to go in just a little bit more just to make sure it comes up but that's not to say it doesn't come up it's just really firmly pressed in so there's no complaints about that but I love this I freaking love this like this blush right here I'm oh it's, it's just perfect I think this blush it just looks perfect on me obviously with this blush now it's definitely more intense so I would definitely say you'd have to go in with a light hand but this this is perfect let's do some swatches and you guys will be able to see for yourself so those are the shades So these shades are really, really nice. I'm really happy with this. So beauties, those are my final thoughts on the new Charlotte Tilbury Beautifying Face Palette. Definitely stay tuned. As soon as those little hypnotic pop little shots that she came out with drop on the UK website, I'm definitely going to be getting my hands on at least maybe one or two. But I think I've about two shades I've got my eye on. Also, her Crystal Glitter Liner, I definitely want to get my hands on that. So as soon as that drops, I'm going to be doing a video on it i've got so much christmas things coming up on my channel i literally went to the home store today and is it too early to pick up christmas decorations i'm filming this video and it's about the second of october libra birthday month you guys know i'm a libra it's my birthday month so i've picked up, picked up two baubles guys like the packets like the pink baubles i like picked up two packets i'm also going to be doing a pink christmas on my channel so i'm gonna get all things pink blush pink it's a blush pink christmas hence the reason you guys are in my room my room is blush pink we're gonna have a blush pink christmas this year guys and it's gonna be better than last year if you guys thought my last year pink christmas was good this is gonna be even better so beauties we definitely have a lot coming up on this channel do make sure you like comment subscribe to the channel and i'll definitely be seeing you guys again soon bye